Hey guys, welcome back to another cleaning video. My name's Katie Satilli. If you're new here and I post videos every Sunday and Wednesday, so don't forget to hit that red subscribe button along with the notification bell before you head out. Today's video is gonna be intended for adults and it's full of cleaning motivation and cleaning inspiration. So I'm starting off with my super messy downstairs. I will be moving upstairs because this is a whole house clean with me video. And right now I'm just gonna be collecting all of the clutter and junk and clothes. I think because we have a two story house, we have so much stuff that just collects downstairs. I don't know if any of you guys have a two story house and have the same problem, but let me know down in the comments if you do or give this video a thumbs up if you have a two story house. So before we get started with just the music, I wanted to ask the question, who out there still has Christmas shopping that you need to do? I know that I'm gonna be posting this video on Sunday, which means there's only a few days left till Christmas. So let me know down in the comments, are you done with your Christmas shopping or do you still have Christmas shopping to do? I'd love to know. So the only way I was getting this cleaning done was my youngest son Hudson was taking his nap and then my middle son who's Bentley was downstairs playing and kind of watching TV and playing with this Play-Doh and he had just come home from his Christmas party and had a ton of little like trinkets and snacks and candy and stuff like that. So right now I'm just picking it all up and trying to make sense of it all. I don't know about you guys, but this time of year is a time of year for clutter. And because of that, I'm gonna be doing a bunch of decluttering videos in January. So make sure that you're subscribed and that you have the bell notifications turned on because I think you guys are gonna really like the content coming up in January. My favorite things to do is spray down the sliding glass window. I feel like it makes such a big difference in my dining room when I have this thing cleaned off and sparkling see-through because normally it has like lots of fingerprints and who knows what else on it because I have three young kids and it's just really hard for me to keep this thing clean. So anyways, I was really excited this day because it had been probably since my last cleaning video since I had cleaned off this window. And I'm not gonna lie, when I do cleaning videos, it helps me a lot to keep things clean. So my husband came home and he was like, wow, the house looks so clean. And I'm like, yes, because I'm finally filming a cleaning video. So um, I think we're all thankful that this video is going up today.
I have another quick question for you guys as I'm helping Bentley with his Play-Doh. I was wondering what kind of content you'd like to see for the year 2020. Are there any requests? Are there any favorite types of videos that you like to see from me or from other YouTubers that you think would be fun to do on my channel? I love getting feedback and ideas from you guys because it just opens up the world of creativity for me. So let me know down in the comments what kind of content you think would be fun to do in 2020 here on my channel. My kitchen is so filled with clutter this time of year. I know you can't see it in this shot, but to the right of the sink is full of like plates of cookies and candies and cakes and breads and gift cards and all kinds of delicious treats. And there really is nowhere for me to put them besides on the counter because we just have a smaller little area in here. But I just figured I'm gonna deal with the clutter while we have these delicious snacks. I'd love to know down in the comments what some of your favorite baked goods are at Christmas time. I know for me, I love getting like fudge or anything chocolate. I just think that it is so, so yummy. But I'd love to hear what your favorites are down in the comments.
later on in the day and I was just getting some laundry started for the upstairs. We have our laundry area, I guess, our laundry nook upstairs in the hallway. So I just wanted to get a load of laundry going. Normally I do this in the morning, but this day I had not done it yet. Sometimes I don't run a load because the other side of this wall is where my son sleeps and takes his nap or he might be still be sleeping in the morning when I wake up. So I don't know, I was trying to get that load going. I try to do a load a day, it keeps the chaos away. It's not always successful, but when I do that, you guys know that it helps me so much. So now I'm just gonna be Windexing this mirror and I think you just saw those huge pink packages, which is all my red Aspen products that come in. If you don't know, I do sell for Red Aspen and I absolutely love working with them and using their products. I just think that they are the most fun makeup company ever. I know it's hard to see because I don't know this shot just kind of looks more white than it actually was but honestly I had not cleaned my sink in so long like this was so disgustingly dirty and <laughs> I wish that you could see like just how grimy it all is do you see how I have to keep going over the mirror in multiple spots because I'm just not getting it fully clean so anyways I like to do this where I spray Windex on the metal part of the sink after I like deep clean it. It just makes it super shiny and I love it. It's like it's smiling back at me when I go to wash my hands. And now I'm heading into the bathroom. I'm gonna be cleaning the toilet. I'm gonna be cleaning the shower area. And definitely using disinfectant spray because my family just had the flu last week and it was not fun and I definitely do not want to have round two. Which leads me to my next question, which is, have you gotten your flu shot? My family and I had not gotten flu shots, so we had the full-fledged flu go around our entire family, except for my daughter, Fiona. So I'm going to try to show you that I'm using the barkeeper's friend right here to clean my shower. I don't always use this, in fact I don't even know if I've ever used this on my shower floor but it worked really really well. And then I just used um, a white, what do you call those things? 
the white little sponge thing. I cannot think of the name for the life of me. But as you can see, my camera was not focusing, but this is what I was using to clean the bottom of the floor and it worked super well. Girl, you should wear a name tag. Just wanted to say thank you guys for watching another video with me. Don't forget to subscribe, give this video a thumbs up, and don't forget to hit the little bell notifications on your way out. I would love to have you stick around and be a part of my subscriber community and have an awesome day.